Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Explained channel. In this session, I am going to discuss about the brief descriptions on wave energy. First, we will discuss what is meant by wave, then where it occurs, then how the wave energy will be present, then how the wave energy will be converted into useful form of energy, that is electricity. Wave is the rise and fall of the water surface at the sea and here at the seashore the tides will be formed. The rise of water will be in the form of tides and if you go to the inside the sea the water level whatever is there it will rise for the certain smaller height and falls that is due to the flow of the air and that is due to the attraction between the earth, sun and moon and that the wave formation will be taking place and the wave whatever is there it is continuously moving from one location to the another location and during its motion it will have the kinetic energy in it okay whenever there is a energy due to its velocity or its motion that is called as a kinetic energy then it will have the kinetic energy in it. then that kinetic energy can be converted into a certain the moments of the uh, some arrangements then the reciprocating motions we are going to get that reciprocating motion we can convert into a rotor motion and that rotor motion if you connect to the generator we can generate the electricity that is the wave energy here we can see that it's one of the form the wave whatever is there the up and down of the sea surface and this pendulum whatever is there whenever the water goes up this also goes up and this whenever there is it will move it will be the whatever this boy is there that will move downwards and they are reciprocating up and down motion in the piston motion we are going to get and that up and down motion whatever is there that is a reciprocating motion will be converted into a rotary motion and the rotary motion if you connect to the generator we can generate the electricity and that is placed inside the uh, sea and similarly here the number of that uh, whatever the such uh, reciprocating piston and cylinder arrangements are used and there the at the number of stations at the number of stations we can generate the electricity and that uh, we, we can connect to the undersea substation and thereby that is connected to a grid through a cables substation and from that one the it will be controlled then that will be supplied to the useful domestic applications and there the, all these are the wave energy converters then here the how the wave energy conversion actually works wave energy is a form of renewable energy that can be harnessed from the motion of waves it is a renewable form of energy because okay that will not uh, uh, get depleted and that will be continuously available in, uh, in the sea and that will not pollute and that is the renewable form of the energy there are several methods of harnessing wave energy that involve placing electricity generator on the surface of the ocean on the surface of the ocean if you place the electricity generators you can generate the electricity from it Depending upon the lunar cycles, tide, winds, weather, wave can vary in size and strength. This will not uh, the continuously the same style, uh, wave heights are available, same wave strengths are available in the sea. That will be varies with the lunar cycles. Means the monthly whatever the rotation of the earth and the moons are there, the lunar cycles and tides, the tides will be producing due to the winds. Okay, then weather that is a uh, season wise the rainy and uh, winter and uh, summer whatever is there due to that also it will be varies in the size and the strength both the waves roll through the ocean the waves continuously rolling through the ocean they create kinetic energy the continuous movement will be create a kinetic energy or a movement this movement can be used for use to power turbines power turbines that one to power supply the power to the turbine this moment can be used which in turn create energy which in turn create the energy 
that can be converted into electricity and power okay that whatever the this moment is there that uh, can be uh, used to run the turbine and thereby that will be converted into electricity there are several ways of harnessing wave energy that utilize the, the up and down motion of the waves to power pistons and turn generators there are several ways are there there are different methods are there and uh, by that one we can generate the that electricity by using the up and down movements of the that we use here one that is a dolphin type machine we are going to discuss and uh, what it consists of that one there are two parts will be there in the power generation in the dolphin type of the a wave energy generation this will be whatever we are going to discuss that with the sketch also we'll discuss the float has two motions the rolling motion about its own plug uh, pulcrum okay about it pulcrum it will be rotate it will be rotate that rotate motion we are going to convert with the connecting rod is amplified and converted into continuous rotate motion with the help of gears and that whatever the rolling motion of that float is there that can be connected through a gears to the generator there we can generate the electricity the electrical generator is driven by that one the other vertical motion is also amplified and converted into motion rotor motion that's the up and down motion also apart from the rotor motion that also connected through a uh, gears and that what will be converted into a continuous rotor motion that will, I will explain with this sketch here. This is the whatever the float is there. This is dolphin type of machine. Here the float, uh, whatever the float is there, this float will be rotate about its own plectrum. Okay, that rotate. And during its rotation, that continuous rotation if we can get and thereby the energy we can generate from it. And that will connect it to here. Even though this wave whatever is there continuous movement, in this direction the this whatever the float is there moves up and down also and this up and down movement will be connected to a this uh, whatever the uh, converters through a connecting rod and here wave energy absorber whatever is there there is up and down motion will be there that will be a reciprocating motion that will be converted into a rotor motion and thereby we can continuous energy also we can generate from it like this uh, two way by using the dolphin type of the wave motion there is a one rotation about the float rotation about its own fulcrum and moving up and down motion okay then uh, energy we can generate in the two way by using this one this is the one of the method there are many methods are there by using the rollings by using the that uh, uh, some of the only few rotation type we are going to use that one this is the whatever the dolphin type of the wave conversion machine the picture directly can have this is the float which will rotate about its own plectrum as own axis and this will move up and down also and here the up and down movements what are there these will be converted into continuous rotary motion in here at the end and there here also can generate the electricity by its rotation float and here also can generate the electricity by the up and down movements as well as by using conversion it and this is the, the another method that is a rolling and here also it is a rolling one okay they are continuously these will rotate during the wave flow and here also the same thing happens that one like this by using the different methods we can use the uh, another source of energy that is a wave energy for the energy production this is the, the another another alternative source of energy and which can be used for the power generation which can be used for the power generation thereby uh, the another alternative a renewable energy source we can use but here the whatever the intensity of the energy is there the intensity of the energy of the wave energy is less and that also having the some of the difficulties to transmit the generated power to the shisho that difficulty is there but even though at the some at the mid sea if the any other sources of the power are not available then we can use this wave energy and the nearer to the uh, sea whatever the some cities if, uh, or the domestic uh, that is residential areas are present there we can uh, connect this wave energy 
generation where the wave energy continuously available there we can use this wave energy conservation methods if the any other source of the energy is not available at that region we can use the this form of energy and that is also one of the advantage as the renewable source of energy it will not cause any harmful to the atmosphere also okay with this thank you for watching if you like uh, comment share and uh, subscribe my channel thank you once again